my lovelies so today i wanted to basically like sit down and talk with you guys i received a box from a really good friend yesterday her name is tonima or nima a lot of people call her that and she is a certified makeup artist and she's absolutely talented i will most definitely leave her links down below or like her tag i think i'm just gonna upload this on instagram but i wanted to basically unbox everything with you guys it's a huge box and it's so cute it says open me here from nima to pratima uh, i used to go to middle school with her but like for the longest while we like stopped talking but now we both added each other on um, instagram once again and we have continuously shown support towards each other and i'm so happy to be unboxing this today i got this yesterday and i've been trying to refrain myself from opening it i'm proud of myself for going 24 hours without opening makeup but i'm excited to do it right now i also got her makeup as well so i'm sure she's gonna make some type of video or picture on it so you guys should follow her to see what i got her so let's open this and not waste any more time and it smells amazing like i'm sure she sprayed perfume on it or something and that perfume bomb so good and it's so cute look at it oh my god look okay so it says open me i'm gonna go for this first and i don't know if i should read it out loud i'm just gonna read it to myself first and see if i can read it out loud and then if so then i'll read it out loud okay, so i'm just gonna read the top part of it it says to my lovely pratima i'm so excited for this collab it's been so fun purchasing these items for you i'm so excited to see you unbox everything and your reaction majority of the products are from small businesses and drugstore brands that i enjoy and love all the products are amazing so i hope you love them too i'm so happy that we catched up so much love for you oh i love this so much oh my god i'm so excited okay all right and she gave like a description of like all the products and girl your handwriting is super cute i don't know what you're talking about it's super cute Okay, first thing, I got a sticker. It's just cute. The packaging is so adorable. I love the pink because I'm a girly girl at heart. Oh, she got me a makeup bag. This is so cute. Okay, so the first thing in the makeup bag is ColourPop. And this is a Super Shock Shadow in the shade Bubbly. Super cute. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And this is what it looks like. Okay. Super cute. Oh, I love this. Oh, Bambi. I got Bambi. Okay, okay. This is um, a ColourPop pressed powder palette. Oh, so cute. Does anybody else like try to like not ruin the packaging so they can put back the product inside the packaging and just keep the packaging? If not, then I'm weird. But I totally do that. Oh, this is so cute. Look at this. These are the colors. Definitely up my alley. I'm in love. I'm in love. And this is what it looks like. I love the art and everything on the palette. And I love how travel friendly it is. These tones. You guys know. These tones are my tones. Okay, so this is a Bambi palette. So freaking cute. Okay, next I got this ColourPop Blush Crush. I think it's like pressed blushes super cute oh no these are eyeshadows okay nine eyeshadows i love this oh my i love like the neutrals mainly because i mostly do like, eyeshadow that has a lot of color i don't really have eyeshadow that's just like neutral so i love this i love 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 this Oh, I'm so excited. And I love the packaging. The packaging is super cute. Look at the, the detail and everything. And this is what the back looks like. And I still love the bag. I'm just going to show you guys up close. Super cute. And especially when you guys want to go and basically travel, you guys can just fill it with makeup, toiletries, whatever. But I love the color of it. Like it just screams summertime. So I love using sponges from small business and i think this one is from a small business i think this is from shy bear cosmetics i think i follow them on instagram but i have been seeing their content oh my god and it's super soft i love the color you guys know i love the color purple and look at this i love that it's slanted as well wow and it's super soft so i'm guessing it's gonna be super absorbent as well and it came in this cute 
little Ziploc baggie. Ooh, what is this? <gasps> Faux wink lashes and the style Stay Shy. Oh, and it comes with a spoolie. Look at that. I love these. These are so cute. You guys know I'm all about Faux Mink lashes because I base my brand around being vegan and cruelty free. But like these are these are cute, really really cute. And it says, "Hey beautiful, ready to start your day? The Shy Bear way." Oh, it's so cute. I know I'm I'm saying like everything's cute, but like look look at the packaging, and look at the lashes and the packaging inside. And then on the back, um, most definitely check them out. It's Shy Bear Cosmetics. I love this. I can't wait to, to do a makeup look with all of these things. Okay, this is also, what is this? Are these clips? These are not traditional clips. And I love that they're gummy bear. Like, okay, so this is the front and this is the back. And you just basically like open it like that. I think they're called like the crocodile hair clips or whatever. But like, these are so cute. Oh my god, okay, wait. You could do your makeup with these as well. Like, and they really pin your hair back. Oh my god, I love this. Do you guys see that? Do you guys see? I'm gonna show you guys again, and I'm gonna show you guys together. I love this. Oh my god, it's so cute. I've never seen anything like this. I've never seen anything like this. Like, this is so unique and, like, so creative. Wow, this is so cute. You guys might see me do my my makeup with these more often. Okay, next. A Pawfic Flush Blush Silky Powdered Blush. This is so cute. You guys, I have recently... Look at that. There's a paw print imprinted inside of it there is a paw print printed inside oh my god okay my love for animals runs so deep and when there's little like well when small business do like little things like these like like it really does take my breath away like i'm just like like this is so cute look at that Okay, so this is in the shade Strawberry. Um, it's a single blush palette by Shy Bear Cosmetics. The last couple of items was from Shy Bear Cosmetics, including those clips. But, oh my god, this is so... Should I swatch? I'm gonna swatch. Ugh, I didn't swatch anything else though. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. You guys know how Colourpop shadows perform. So I'm just gonna... I don't want to mess the pop print up. This is like something... I'm, I'm not gonna want to use like I'm gonna want to keep popping forever just like have my my brush go around the product I mean around the popper okay so this is what it looks like and then I'm just going to okay I like the sheen that it gives me I and I also like that she chose to give me a darker color because as you guys can tell I'm of darker skin so this would look super good on my skin complexion I absolutely love this though I cannot wait to like actually put it on my face I wish I can do it today but I can't because I'm going out pretty soon and I don't have time to do my makeup as well okay so this is also from Shire Bear Cosmetics oh it's a pen super cute I'm probably gonna put this in like my book bag or something, like on my book bag. And then there's a couple stickers. Oh man, this is so cute. Look at this. Oh, and this is their business card. I love the theme. I feel like it's super girly and it's super me. Like I'm, I, I love this so much. Okay, so these are all the stickers and business cards. And I got two lollipops as well from them, from Nima. And then I got, I think these are liquid liners. Yeah, these are totally liquid liners. It is the Sweetie Cake Eyeliner. And this is in this, now they don't have shades, but this is a pinky one. This is so cute. I've always wanted to try these. And now I have the opportunity to. They're so cute. This is the white one. And this is the peach one. 
And I guess this is the brush to go along with it as well. I totally appreciate this because I don't think I have a brush shape like this. I absolutely loved everything that I got. I'm getting so far and I still have more to go. So this is a satin drawstring bag. Wet and Wild Flat Kabuki Pro. Okay. So I have always wanted the NARS one. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about, but NARS has a brush like this. I've always wanted it from my contour. I've always seen like Jacqueline Hill use it in her like makeup tutorials. Like, but this was like years ago and this is so adorable. This is SpongeBob and this is a, I think this is the, the flat Kabuki brush. You could totally use this for like contours and stuff like that. Oh yeah, you can use it for highlighter too. I totally see myself using this for a highlighter, like especially like cream highlighter, just like pat it in or like cream bronzer and just like, oh, I love this. I've always wanted the NARS one, but it was just too expensive. So I've always bought dupes off of Amazon, but now I get one from Wet n Wild. This is so adorable. So freaking adorable. Oh, and she got me a highlighter too from Wet n Wild. Okay, this is a SpongeBob one. It's the limited edition one. Oh, it's in the shade SpongeBob. Look at it. It even has an impressed SpongeBob inside of the highlighter. See, like, I'm also gonna wanna just like use over here and not like get SpongeBob messed up, but. This is super cute and I love the gold. The only other gold highlighter that I really have is the Fenty Beauty one in the shade Trophy Wife, I think it is. But this is so cute. Oh my god. Do you guys see this? Okay, next. I can't believe we're still going. I cannot believe we're still going. This is Garnier Skin Active Soothing Facial Mist made with rose water. It's vegan. I love this. I especially since I grew up using the Mario Badescu one but I ended up hearing that it's not so good for you so I'm excited to try this one and I want to see how it like makes my makeup look can you use it after makeup or you use it before makeup mist 12 to 15 inches from the face with eyes and mouth shut whenever your skin needs a boost of refreshment I think you'll use it before makeup it's a soothing toner mist yeah i think i'll use it before makeup and see or like after i'm finished with like cleansing my skin and see how this helps my skin but as you guys can tell like i have like um acne marks still left over on my face from my acne days given that i still kind of get acne here and there but i've never really like had a solution as to like how i should get rid of those and i heard like rose water really helps with it as well so i'm excited to try this one out mainly because it kind of is an insecurity of mine but it's an insecurity that i'm trying to work out you know that's why i'm not wearing makeup right now trying to let my skin breathe so i'm excited to try this one out all right next is this one okay okay so this says uh this is from the brand shop vvs vanity and i'm pretty sure this is a lip mask this is from vvs vanity and this is the lip garden lip gloss which is super cute i love the just like the bottle itself, I know like Beauty Bay Pretty uses the same type of lip gloss too, but I love how her writing is pink and look at the flowers inside of it. Like, can you, do you guys see that? And I love that it's milky. It just looks so elegant and this, it's so cute. Like, I'm sure if I like go out with this, people will ask me like where I got it from. BBS Vanity, but yes. I love that. I want to try it. Okay, I really do want to try it. I'm going to try it right now. I'm curious. Okay. okay, it's not sticky. It's very, very, very smooth. If you guys have tried my lip gloss, it's a tiny bit thinner, but it's super, super, super smooth, which is such a good thing. I'm curious to see what she put inside of it. I'll link it or I'll like put it down below, like what different type of oils she's used, she used. But I absolutely love this. I love the look of it, the feeling of the lip gloss. It's so beautiful and I can't wait to basically like show off in like public and be like, oh, look at my lip gloss, you know? And this is the peppermint lip butter. So this is what it looks like. 
this is the inside and I'm, I'm excited to use this because i don't really know a lot of people that have lip butters i'm thinking it's like a lip balm but i can be wrong i'll most definitely update you guys when i do a review or like a makeup look i'm gonna use these to like prep myself so i'm excited i'm so excited to use all of these hold on let me go on the website so yes i was right it is a lip balm it's made with shea butter vitamin e oil and yeah like i said it's super 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 smooth yeah like i said it says that it's a hydrating lip balm so yes i was right i'm excited to use this i i've only used like a handful of like honestly less than five of lip balms in my life so i'm excited to see how this one is so the last thing that i'm going to unwrap is by i think it's rogue mood cosmetics yes it is rose mood cosmetic the packaging is super adorable so first things first oh this is a liquid lip kit and it's in this shade brown sugar milk tea and you guys know i love my darker um lip glosses lipsticks lip whatever i love darker shades and i'm gonna swatch it for you guys so this is what the pencil looks like lip liner and right away guys it's super 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 creamy so that's what it looks like and i barely applied pressure like like let that sink in guys i barely applied pressure i kind of like the packaging that it this comes in it's super sleek not your usual liquid lipstick container and i like that it's different so i'm just going to that was like only two swipes like literally i went like that and that's it you guys see that oh, i love this i you guys if you guys have ever or if you if you guys have gone to high school with me you guys know that i used to wear brown lipsticks all the time they were my thing even if i when i used to go out brown lipsticks were my thing and it is most definitely gonna replace limbo by colourpop because i used to use limbo by colourpop all the time that was the brown that i used to use and i remember it because i used to use it all the time so again this is a brown sugar milk tea lip kit the foodie kiss lip kit and i cannot wait to do my makeup especially to like use these products as well guys do not sleep on small businesses like small business makeup don't do it okay so i'm gonna open this. this is the rogue mood you got cyber mail container welcome to the club rogue mood okay so this is basically like a little business card and i love how cute this box is it's so tiny and cute it's a business card that lights up it is a business card that lights up guys do you do you see that a business card that lights up this is so creative. Oh my god. Okay, I need to step it up. Like beauty maybe just need to step it up. But like like do you guys see that? this is so cool. I love like the theme to every small business. Like Shy Bear Cosmetics was very girly and you know um surrounded by animals. And I just love that like this is like so innovative. Like it's like it's like kind of like the future, you know? This is their high cheeks ombre blushes you guys i don't know if this video is gonna be too long for, you, for instagram if it is i'll just upload it to youtube or i don't know if i should do it in like two parts oh and this is in the shade of mango so this is the rogue mood high cheek ombre blush in the shade mango y'all ain't ready for this look at this look at it look at the ombre the only time i've ever seen something like this is by one brand in sephora and i totally forgot what that brand is but that don't matter anymore because i got rogue mood cosmetic blush that's giving me the ombre effect. like i this is so beautiful this is so beautiful guys i want to swatch it i want to like i feel like this is like the perfect blush for the summertime right and the other one by shy bear cosmetics this one is the perfect blush for winter time so i get a win-win like i get a blush for both summertime and winter time like look at look at the, the differences between the two blushes this one will most definitely make me look sun-kissed and this one will basically like bring some color back to my skin when i become a little bit lighter in the winter time because i'm not really going outside but yeah like this is oh, they're so cute oh and look at how the liquid lipstick just dried down and that was so quick but yeah it's like a matte and it does not budge y'all 
I'm in love with everything. I just want to make sure that's everything and that I'm not missing anything. I am so excited to try out everything that I got today. I'm so excited. Oh my god, I cannot believe y'all like like don't sleep on small businesses do not sleep on small businesses like i got some amazing things today like i i mean usually i do gravitate towards sephora and ulta i'm not gonna lie but that's because that's how i grew up but now oh no 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 the game has changed for me the game has most definitely changed for me i am going to shop small from now on because guys like can you believe like the things that i got today like like this this stunned me the most like this stunned me the most this is so beautiful but nonetheless i still love everything that i got from like the things from wet and wild to the things from ColourPop to the things from shy bear cosmetics to the things from vivia's vanity to the things from rogue mood cosmetics i cannot believe the things that i received today they're so cute thank you guys all for sitting with me and unboxing everything with me i really want to do more of these like basically like makeup swap with other content creators because they can open your eyes to newer makeup that you basically haven't seen yet so i'm so excited to do this in the future and let me know if we should do a part two with nima because and if you guys like this check out nima's um instagram i will link it down below or tag her down below i still don't know where i'm gonna upload this probably youtube now because i have been filming for 34 minutes everything that i got today i love like i can't i'm just so stunned at like the things from small businesses like y'all like this lip gloss the blush the other blush like thank you guys for watching check out nima's instagram down below and she will be unboxing mines pretty soon so check her out to see what i got her and to see how she used the products that i got her on her face Thank you again, Nima. I loved everything. I can't believe you got me all these things. But yeah, thank you. But yeah, I'll see you guys in my next post or in my next video. Bye.